please consider joining us on our website. You'll have access to Interesting Minds, Rhyme Series, and a tutorial so you can see how I do it. I can't guarantee you'll figure it out, but I will teach you how I see people. We're so angry, hating everyone we don't know. We can't even take a joke. We should really let it go. Let it go, though. And be happy. Stop talking on our phones. Yeah. I'm blocking everyone we know. Yeah. We've been being buttholes. Being buttholes. So go to watch Carl this morning. But I didn't get to see Carl. I got to see this ad first. And at first, I was like, ah, five second delay. Cannot skip. Cannot skip. But I'm encouraging all of you to go and watch his video and you'll find out why I could not skip. I would say his song represents 99% of the world at this point, which is why we're doing this video. Also, remember, when you're looking at someone, you're looking at them at that moment. The moment in time, that is where their mind is at and that is what you will see. For all I know, he could be a cannibal. It kind of matches with the tattoos and the hair and the teeth and the rings. But as I watched him, I just saw a big old teddy bear. Looking all tough, but really just a good person. Action! Where do these moves come from? All right, I'm ready. All right, let's go. Ready? Yeah. Give me the wave. Three. Nope. Maybe the fence. That's, I'm ready. Okay, ready? Yeah. Action. Hello me, future me. <laughs> so you've just seen a montage that they put together at their outtakes. And you are seeing how open he is with his little antics. One, when you see personalities, there's certain things you get from people. If they're really closed off, they're real tight, and you go, oh, scared, hurt. You know, and living in that pain all the time. They live in it, which is not a good place to be in someone's mind because you can be hurt and not live in it. And those people who are constantly tight and they're drawing it in, living in trauma, that's not a good place to be. And to see this guy, he's out, his arms are open, he's making jokes. Mind you, he is with people that he more than likely trusts. Which brings me to another point. I gather that the woman is either a wife, girlfriend, basically his partner. And how you treat the person that you supposedly love says a lot about your personality. So when we see him interacting just a little briefly, we don't see a demanding, we don't see overpowering, we don't see a shortness in temper. We see a very happy personality. Of course, this is cut. We are not naive to that. But the fact that even in this realm that you can be irritated or not, but you can see the happiness in it says that the mind doesn't stay in anger. The mind goes to happiness. Anger is for the moment and stay in positive for the rest of the time. Just to clarify why the phone's there. Part of this is acting, so to speak. So the phone is his song playing so he can know where to be and how to act to that particular area of the song. Babe? Yeah. So we're smacking ourselves. Apparently we're getting eaten up by bugs. You don't see irritation. You get some people and they're just irritated. It's like, this is what you wanted to do. And here you are mad at something you wanted to do. But no, we don't see that personality type here. <laughs> we see someone who actually puts a smile into it before it cuts. This is like, <laughs> yeah. Whether there were actual bugs there, I don't know. I also would like to say, as we look at him, as he's standing there, he's not posing like he's in some kind of muscle magazine. He's in underwear outside near the woods being stared at, I'm sure by more than one person, maybe just one, but regardless, it's like, oh my gosh, all of my vulnerabilities, everything that I may not like about myself, one is being videotaped and in the moment I'm being looked at. And two, this is about to go to everyone in the world, possibly seeing it. And we see humility, the slight slouch. It's a very slight slouch arms down at his side. They're kind of stiff. They're not completely relaxed, but they're not flailed open and making obscene like, oh, I'm Hercules. They're not doing that. They're just down at his side. The head, not meek or weak, but humble. It's a, almost just a slight downward angle. The legs together. Humility, modesty. 
even though he is in his underwear. I know that kind of contradicts it, but there's modesty in that. I'm sure he made some antics because he seems to have that personality of, you know, once he gets too uncomfortable to make a big joke out of it. Whether you're younger, smarter, dumb, or where you're from, or what you make, though. You're making that insane face again. I like that. You're making that insane face again, which is, <laughs> it's good. Her interaction with him, one, it's showing that her interaction to him is calming and it's good. And he gives a genuine smile to her. Also, it says a lot about the relationship as well. Now, yeah, great. One more time. No. That's all you're going to give me? Yeah. Okay. No. Body's down. Hips are out. Trying to stay in strength. Shoulders to the side. Elbow comes up. Goes into humility. It's always nice and it's so refreshing to see someone who's got this kind of talent. They're really good, at least for the version that I've seen. And not see a fool. You see a decent guy, good heart, being himself. So refreshing. I also like people who are very good to animals. It's just, you know, how you treat the lower species is definitely a insight into the mind as well. <laughs> I love it so much. The horse is following him without a lead. <laughs> Whatever bond these two have come up with, that I'm talking about the horse. <laughs> he obviously feels, oh, this human's trustworthy. I shall follow you anywhere. If you like it, please share and subscribe. Thanks for watching.